smell is can oftentimes get boring, but today I'm going to show you how to make an exciting one from the La Boulange cookbook. We're going to be making the warm goat cheese salad. Let's get started. You're going to need 8 cups of spring salad mix, 11 ounces of goat cheese, 2 tablespoons of French herbs, so I'm using thyme, rosemary, dill, and chives, 1 egg, half a cup of breadcrumbs, 24 candy pecans, 12 grape or cherry tomatoes cut in half, and then for the dressing, 2 tablespoons of olive oil, 2 tablespoons of balsamic vinegar, a pinch of salt, and a pinch of ground pepper. First, in a bowl, mix your goat cheese and herbs and form them into a ball. Put them on a plate and put it in the fridge for about two hours until it's firm and set. Now let's prepare your balsamic vinaigrette. Mix together your balsamic vinegar, salt and pepper and stir until the salt dissolves. Then while whisking, slowly drizzle in the olive oil until it emulsifies and forms a nice vinaigrette. Then set it aside. Now take your egg and whisk it well into a bowl. This is going to be your egg wash for the goat cheese. Take your goat cheese out of the fridge once it's firmed up and then piece by piece dip it into the egg and then dip it into the breadcrumbs. The egg is what's acting as a glue to grip the breadcrumbs onto the goat cheese. Now on the stove, heat up a skillet on medium high heat and coat it with some olive oil. Then take your goat cheese and pan fry each side until it's golden brown. And there's your warm goat cheese. Now it's time to assemble the salad. First, take your balsamic vinaigrette and then drizzle about two tablespoons. Next, toss in your candied pecans and cherry tomatoes and then toss it well. Now, scoop out a little bit of the salad onto a plate and then place your warm goat cheese on top. And there you have it, your warm goat cheese salad. Let's give it a try. It's so interesting and I love the crispiness of the goat cheese on the salad. It gives it a little bit of tang, but also a little bit of a crunch too. What do you do to spruce up your salads? Comment below and share this recipe with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!